Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting during to episode 7 of Tacto Opening Destiny. So let's gotta get started in 3, 2, 1. Hold on. In 3, 2, 1, go. I need to like adjust. Yep, that's better. Oh, damn. Nah, Destiny. <laughs> yes, you and your fucking tap him. <laughs> God, babe, you got bags under your eyes. You need sleep. Oh my God, sir. <laughs> I hated being busy, super duper busy this week, because I was not able to watch this on Tuesday. And then I wasn't able to watch, like, all the other things that I was supposed to watch, which mean, well, I watch, I typically watch Call Me on Fridays. Um, but Tuesday and Thursday, busy! <laughs> and I had no time, and I was just like, okay, I gotta do this on Friday. I was like, that's, like, kind of the only day this week that I'm semi-free to get this done. And I still got other stuff that I was supposed to get done that I wasn't able to do, that I gotta do tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. Tomorrow or Sunday. And then, like, see, it's even weird. Next week is freaking Thanksgiving. This month has gone by like that. And I'm like, bruh, are you kidding me? And and then I feel like December is going to be like that, too. And then next thing you know, it's going to be January. And uh, Like, are you serious? <laughs> like, I just, I don't even believe that next week is Thanksgiving. Because it feels like just yesterday, November just started. Why are we going so fast? <laughs> like, that's all I want to know. The world is preparing us for something, that's why. Yeah, but are you doing it in the right way, though? The Grand Maestro. Are we going to see the Grand Maestro? Oh, okay, so, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> I mean, no offense, like it seems like Tacto has better leadership skills than you. He kind of reminds me of that one guy from um, Black Bullet who does not like um, <laughs> Rock <laughs> Rentado. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
God damn, it looks like it, very similar to when it gets a hurricane season here in Florida. Hmm. It's not exactly safe anywhere. Destiny. <laughs> My depressing emo son. <laughs> Please get some sleep. Like, seriously. Oh. I mean, well, damn, Destiny, you didn't have to do that. You said it was an opening? Aww. Of course. No, I mean, but... I don't think so. I mean, a keyboard? <laughs> exactly. I don't think like D2s would be something because I mean, yeah, that thing is so small that I like, mm, you can barely hear it. I mean, Destiny, damn. Well, yeah, because you transformed out of nowhere! But you're a team! A team! You do something together! I love her, but, like, it's just, you know, we have the independent bad bitch syndrome. We are so fucking independent that we don't need anybody else. And I love that. But you're a team!
to go eat sweets, let me guess. God, I just, I need him to sleep. <laughs> the fucking bags under his eyes, I can't. Say, mm -mm. getting food. <laughs> You're just tailing her. There's nothing wrong with that. so sweet. Uh-oh. Mm. <laughs> she likes sweets. Yeah, because I don't think the kid has ever seen a lollipop. Pops, did you buy it, babe? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Good though. Yeah, that's the biggest thing I'm wondering too. Because sometimes it feels like in certain little moments that Cosette is coming out from Destiny, but who knows?
Jesus Christ, child. I mean, did you need that much syrup? <laughs> Please eat. Well, yeah, because she's not Cosetto. She's Destiny now. <laughs> I mean, because come on. Will Cosette be this savage? <laughs> Because you've known her. Well, damn, I didn't... Mm. Well, it don't even look like it's harming anybody. I mean, dang. The thing is, are Leon and Titan gonna make it like quickly by the end of this episode? because he hasn't been able to sleep, eat, whatever. This was a trap, wasn't it? Yeah, of course. Of course! That's one of those, um, things. I just don't remember. It's a sound thing, Majiggy. Learned about that crap in chorus.
course, because he wants all that glory and fame. Oh God, please don't say it's that They're, they're gonna end it right there. Yeah, okay. Yeah, SOBs. But the fact is, it was because of him? What he did to Koza. Oh, God. Can we kill him, please? Like, oh. But am I surprised that, you know, his music are hell and him are the quote unquote villains of the show? Not really, because I didn't trust him when we saw him last week. I mean, not, no, not even last week. The week before last week's episode. Because something, when he came on between the point of episode one and two, so like three between three, four, and five, because this is, up, no, three, four, five, and six. When he first came on to the scene and he interacted with Takto, Destiny, and um, <clears throat> uh, Anna, he felt weird to me. And I was like, okay. And then, you know, also him, you know, ditching Valkyrie. Something about that wasn't right to me. I was like, okay, you, your music art is hell. We all get that. But the fact is you are literally dumping, dumping, somewhat breaking up with Valkyrie. That don't sit right with me. And then his, he has an obsession with Takto and you can see it initially in this episode so the fact is that he's the reason why like all the freaking d2s are showing up are you fucking kidding me like hold up not only that but the situation with cosette like oh <laughs> sir you need to die you need a slow torturous painful like no <laughs> Painful, big behind pain death because sir like because of you Cosette is now Destiny and we don't even know if Destiny is gonna if Cosette is gonna come back because of you Everything that has happened is because of you now if he would have said The ish like thinking like because at first like at first I was thinking okay hold on wait are, are we talking about like his dad is he the reason why his dad's dead and such and then when it flashed to Cosette I was like oh, okay no also that but if they would have showed like a flashback of him of him in hell sending D2s to kill Takto's dad I would have been floored I would have been going off I'm already going off on this but this dude is such an a-hole I mean seriously he does remind me of the character in Black Bullet of the show that I'm currently watching now for Patreons where this dude he he's also very like for both of these two in the situations that they are both in for these shows as villains they're both like sign of what kind of like the head of like of not really of this organization but they're like the second in command so they're not the number one they're like maybe the number five number ten whatever 
an ish. But because they still get orders from that big head honcho, and because of the fact that they're like, oh, okay, we need to get Rentado slash Tacto coming this way on our side and such, and you know how our head honcho, which for this show it's a guy, and then for Black Bullet it's a female, um, and how they're saying, like, yes, he is important, but we don't need him for now. And then they become very much obsessive with the character, and they're, they're trying to do everything impossible to get this character killed. So, am I going to be surprised if he dies next week? No. I really won't. Because he just, he's an asshole, like, a character. And he needs to go. Him and Hell. I, hell, you know what, if Hell dies next week... I ain't gonna be mad at it, because, I mean, I like her. She's very, um, ever since she's come into this show, she's very different from most of the music arts. Yes, she's very much, like, obsessed with, uh, Destiny, and she wants to know how Destiny, you know, ticks and thinks and everything, because she's like, yeah, but, like, somewhat, like, I feel like it's almost like an obsessive love, because, you know, she's never met a music art like destiny so she wants to know a lot more about her almost like mm, how should i say this almost wants to become her now, i don't know really because i mean we got to see more continuing on to this show but i want her to die like i'm sorry <laughs> like yeah she's cool but she need to go Hell needs to go. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode 7 of Talk Doll Opening Destiny. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Show the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially on Tuesday. Because, <laughs> you know, of course, I'm sorry. I did not mean, the, mean for this to come out on Friday. But busy-ish. But I will see you guys on Tuesday for episode 8. Bye, guys.